Let me sit down. Make a motion. Uh, I move to amend the ordinance to include the changes in the proposed amendment. Uh -oh. Second. Oh. Discussion. just echo the comments made by Ms. Bailey in that I thought we had reached some sort of agreement and consensus on the blue line version. Uh, no one spoke out against it um, at the time of the last meeting, and I think it encapsulates a uh, suitable resolution uh, to this issue. And I'm frankly also dismayed as to why there's an amended uh, ordinance before us. Any further discussion? Okay, so uh, clear, Mr. Braun, we have the uh, ordinance introduced and read for the second time. Point of order. Point of order. You're, you're voting right now on whether to amend the ordinance that you will then vote on. You have to first vote on amending it. Okay, and to clarify, the amendment states what? The amendment is what was circulated to council. It's labeled proposed amendment. And it's a, a rewritten version of the ordinance that was in the packet. Mr. Phelps. Uh, is there any way that we can vote on the original ordinance first? If, if the amendment fails, then the original amendment will carry. And you'll vote on that. This is an effort to first amend that. So if it's amended, then you're now voting on the amended transient vendor ordinance, not the one that was in the packet. Just for further clarification, the motion to amend would replace it. replaces the ordinance that was presented previous with this one. That's right. Is there any discussion? Uh, Ms. Bailey. Uh,